In this video, I'll share what I consider to be the top five online master degree programs in data science for under $30,000, which means you can earn a degree with great career potential from top universities for not a lot of money compared to other programs that cost two or three times as much. Now I'm all for continuous learning and having something to show for it, but I also don't wanna to have to break the bank to do it. So here's how I'll be breaking down the five programs. I'll talk about cost, which fortunately in the case of these online programs, the majority of it tends to be just tuition. There simply aren't as many additional costs that you might find with a traditional on-campus program. And of course, the nature of online degree programs are such that you can continue to work for the time that you're completing the degree, which means you don't lose out on income for one to two years. I'll also share some details about their rankings per US News and World Report. I'll look at national university rankings so you have some sense for the reputation of the university itself in the US. And also their ranking for computer science. Now, why computer science? That's because data science is relatively new and because it's really a multidisciplinary degree that combines computer science with statistics and occasionally some business courses, all of which exist in established fields with their own programs and their own rankings. But of those, I consider the computer science ranking to be the most meaningful proxy to a university's data science program. And finally, the way that I've ranked these programs are in terms of what I consider to be value, which is a combination of their ranking and their cost. So it's not simply just all about the ranking, it's more the ranking in relation to what you're spending, which in turn is an indication of some of the career prospects you might have upon graduation. With all that said, let's talk about the programs. Coming in at number five is Purdue University with their MS in Data Science. The university's national ranking comes in at 46 and their computer science program ranking comes in at 19. And the cost of the program is at $28,000. So here you've got a well-recognized university with a strong computer science program that offers a fairly affordable data science degree. However, this particular degree offering is relatively new for Purdue, at least in its online format, which from everything that I've read and can tell, appears to have launched in 2024. So to be candid, there's not a ton of feedback or reviews that I've seen about this particular program, especially compared to the others that I'll be talking about. But because of its ranking, its reputation, and its pretty low cost, it's on my list of programs to consider and at minimum, keep an eye on in the coming years as more people pursue the program and complete it. Coming in at number four is the University of Colorado Boulder with their MS in Data Science. University is ranked 98, their computer science program ranked at number 40, and the cost is just under $16,000. While the rankings aren't as good as Purdue, it's still a great school and the cost is quite a bit lower. What's also great about this program is that there are courses online from this program that you can already take and that's through Coursera. The content that's available on Coursera comes from the program, it's pre-recorded lectures from the faculty that teaches these courses, and there are assignments and exams you can take through that. So if you're considering this program and maybe you're a bit on the fence about it, you can take some of these courses on Coursera for a tiny fraction of the cost and see if the full-fledged degree program is something you might be interested in pursuing. Now it also shows that if you complete some of these courses, you can actually apply the completion credits towards the degree program. If it actually does, that's actually quite good. I'm a little bit skeptical because in theory, you could take these courses, complete them for very little money, then apply to the program, get in and have the credits apply to it, and you kind of get away with paying a lot less. Something tells me that's maybe a little bit too good to be true. In either case, the program being just under $16,000 is pretty incredible in and of itself. Coming in at number three is the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign with their Master of Computer Science in data science. The university is ranked number 33 and their computer science program is ranked fifth. The program comes in at a cost of $24,000. This is the highest ranked computer science program 
in this list. What's crazy is that this is ranked just outside the likes of MIT, UC Berkeley, Stanford, Carnegie Mellon, all of whom are tied for first. Whereas University of Illinois is a top ranked program for just $24,000 that you can complete online. Fun fact, I did my MBA through this university through an online program. I had a really great experience and the university has only continued to invest more and more into the online learning experience. This particular program, like my MBA that I did, houses all the pre-recorded lectures on the Coursera platform. And you can kind of consider that the modern textbook because there will also be live sessions that happen in addition to other assignments and actual formal exams to take. So it's quite a bit more than simply Coursera content. One note is that this program appears to be a computer science degree just with a data science track or specialization. So there will be some foundational courses that are less data science-y, but fortunately, not a lot. You'll still have plenty of courses to choose from that are definitely in the category of data science. Coming in at number two is Georgia Tech's online masters in analytics. The university is ranked 33 and their computer science program is ranked seventh. The most amazing fact about this program is that the cost is just $11,000. Now I debated putting this one here because it is termed as an analytics degree. However, this is a program that I've actually been considering for years. And I actually follow a pretty active subreddit forum for students and alumni of this program. Now, although it doesn't have data science in the degree name, what you learn and the credential that you gain from it can certainly be applied to data science roles. Now, the reason the school kept it as an analytics degree, from what I understand, is that because data science is a relatively new term, a new field, and the analytics program was created well before the term data science came into vogue, they didn't want to change the name just to latch on to the latest trends that could ultimately be overtaken by something else. Something like, I don't know, you might have heard of it, artificial intelligence, machine learning. Analytics is enough of a catch-all term that it can be applied in many different fields. Nonetheless, this is one of three top-ranked programs. It's an extremely rigorous program. The time commitment is easily anywhere from 15 to 20 hours a week, and that's just for a single class. Now, obviously, your mileage may vary depending on your background and your comfort level with the material, but I'd read many instances where people have had formal experience and even education in programming or statistics or had strong engineering backgrounds still having to invest a ton of time in all this coursework. But for $11,000 at a top engineering, a top computer science school, the value is close to impossible to beat. At best, you could match it with this next program. Coming in at number one is the University of Texas MS in Data Science. The university is ranked 30, their computer science program is ranked number seven, and the cost, believe it or not, is also around $11,000. Now the University of Texas is where I did my undergraduate business degree in marketing. It's a great university, well known around the globe. In terms of university and computer science ranking and cost, this is about as close of a match you can get to Georgia Tech. In fact, these two programs are often cited as the hands down best values when it comes to a data science or an analytics degree. Most people I've seen considering such a degree are absolutely considering these two. Now when comparing coursework, this one seems a little bit more in depth as it relates to data science, whereas Georgia Tech offers a little bit more breadth as it teaches a little bit of a lot of different tools and methodologies and it pulls in courses from their business school. But you should expect that this program is every bit as rigorous as Georgia Tech's. So really with both programs being highly ranked with just about the same price points, it's a matter of where you would like your future network to be located geographically, either Atlanta, Georgia or Austin, Texas. In my case, as an example, I already have a degree from the University of Texas, so I'd be inclined to go with 
Georgia Tech in order to diversify my educational background and also diversifying my network a little bit more. There are going to be prospective hiring managers out there that maybe have more of an affinity with Georgia Tech or with University of Texas. And if I'm able to check another box, maybe something that's different than what I've already done in the past, that to me seems to be the most practical thing to do. So as you're exploring this program, as well as maybe the others, think about how you're diversifying where you're getting your education from. But between this program and the last one, it's really hard to go wrong. Folks, hope this video helped. If you're at all interested in other online degree programs, I've got plenty of content on online MBAs and some of the programs that I've recommended in the past. So make sure to check those videos out next. With that said, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you around.